governor of Ebony State, David Umayi, has said the security challenges of the state in the southeast region are not similar. Thus, cannot be solved with a joint security network. Umayi, the chairman of the Southeast Governors Forum, also said that the governors in the region were contented with the different security designs in the state because the personnel were working well. He said this during an interview on Channel's television on Thursday. He said, what we have in Southeast East is a joint security committee which trains neighborhood watch and the vigilante groups or other local security architectures at different states in the region. If anybody tells you that there could be security personnel contributed from different states to form joint security for this region, it is not a possibility. It is not workable even if the constitution permits it. Every state is peculiar and is there are security challenges. The problem is that those complaining about the lack of joint security for the Southeast are not living in the region. They don't have the knowledge of how security works in the region. The governors of the Southeast states are comfortable with the different security architectures at various states because the personnel are working very well. But why did you not say that you were working on that before now? Why, what made you change your mind? Hmm. You said our local security architectures at different states know the terrain and the people very well and are given the opportunity to secure their environments and the people. This is the kind of arrangement we have in the Southeast region, he said. <laughs> well, we've talked about this and but the man is still insisting that joint security, regional security is not going to help. And we are like, seriously? <laughs> He speaks like a coward and rightfully so. The truth remains that they don't have the lever to oppose Eastern Security Network despite the pressure from their masters in Abuja. If he even speaks against Eastern Security Network, then his own is over. When a Nigeria governor wants to sound politically correct in order to please Abuja, even if it is at the detriment of his people, whom he swore to protect is tragic. The judgment of history is coming. We share we shall remember. That is because you people sitting at the end of affairs are incompetent leaders, errant boys of the Fulani Caliphates and shameless cowards. Mr. Governor, speak for yourself. Don't stir the anger of your vulnerable people. You are supposed to protest but left unprotected. But thank God for Eastern Security Network that came in to fill in the gap. Yes, we already knew that you people are politically caged to make, to make any better an ideal decision, ideal decision for your people. Hence, the decision to institute Eastern Security Network was made without consulting you people and without making it legal because the Fulani not will do everything possible to destroy them, to subject the people vulnerable to the hand of their killer henchmen. Stop troubling yourself, Umahi. Eastern Security Network come to stay. Has come to stay. You are not the government, rather the people are. If the people are in support of support and are giving their uh, cooperation, what you think, no or support is irrelevant. Even Southeast knew well that they are not ready for the unity among themselves. <laughs> uh, the greatest mistake that the Southeast made was to use turn by turn to pick Southeast Governors Forum Chairman because this buffon would have been up for consideration if it was on merit. In short, you don't have the social skills to cooperate, collaborate with and coordinate in large numbers. Some of us understand the underlying factors of an um, this whole thing. Eastern Security is the only security network we endorse in Eastern Region. Any other security networks, uh, boys, brigade, support Eastern Security Network to save lives. Well, smart response from the governor at least you use your brain this time well because we have an already turning already running security outfit that is very effective and as for your excuse being that the state have their peculiar security challenges that is rubbish but it is a good excuse to pacify those vested interests with due respect mr governor we have we have an have passed this stage please sir, stop dragging us backward be visionary and wake up from your dreams. Security outfits are created by state governors, not for the entire region. So Eastern Security Network can be funded by a governor. 
you can't have a single security net of people like this don't believe Biafra is possible. The South East should do away with such elements. But you want to be president of South East Extraction. Why not a president of Ebony Extraction? And you are chairman of South East Governors Forum. Something serious is wrong somewhere. We don't have leaders but actors. Just put pride aside. Tell us that Eastern Security Network has taken control of the region. You governors will not die if you say the truth. Say the truth and you shall be free. They are all playing policies. They are just playing to the gallery. I said this before now that these people do not have anything uh, serious to do. Since how many years they've been talking about it? Even this year, they came up with uh, this uh, security outfit, not knowing that uh, they were just using it to mark time to postpone the evil day, but now he has come out to say it's not going to be possible because for how long are you going to be deceiving people? They are going to do this, you are going to do that. For how long are you going to be doing that? No, it's not going to happen. So he has just come out so that people will allow him to rest. But thank God for Eastern Security Network that came at the appropriate time because what are we going to be saying? I think the people are to decide what they want from the government. David Mai is just an individual and not a people. They may likely send him to God for judgments. Eastern security, we know. Any other Nakansa fit, the handlers of ESN are whiter than snow and we always work towards protecting lives and properties. Where are the Eastern governors when their counterparts in other regions were forming their own security network? They were busy allocating land for Ruga settlements. Now our big brother has given us our pride back by establishing eastern security network they have come to size him up how does what the governor said translate to disunity in south east some of you read with us uh, doing what is uh, and how to comprehend finally has accepted eastern security network indirectly they have no choice but to concur because the fear of uh, namdi is the safety of kanu a person with each with such eyeglass can't see the problem in the east. Maybe you are talking about Eastern Security Network that you did not create or support. Exactly. Exactly, exactly the points. Exactly the points. They have taken your job for you. Amoteko is not a security outfit. OPC is. But ES, ESNO, even they are marvelous. Imagine when two out of all governors in old eastern region backs and fund them. Men. Those guys won't mind becoming a nuclear power. So guys, let's say your opinion concerning this.